a day in the life of a reseller. So I am up early. I'm gonna make sure I get the dog for a walk, get my exercise in. Then we'll head home and get ready to start printing labels so that we can get our shipping done. After that five mile walk though, I'm hungry. So let's get something to eat and then we'll get our dishes done. So we've got several packages going out today, which is great. The first one is this Christmas sweater that I got at the bins. I paid 84 cents for it and accepted a super low ball offer of $12. I accepted the super low ball offer because Christmas is just around the corner and I didn't want to hang on to this thing until next year. The next thing that sold is a silky white robe that I paid $2.99 for at a retail Goodwill and I got a very fair offer for it. Up next is this Maeve by Anthropology black wrap dress that I got at the bins. I paid about $1.89 for it and sold it for $35. This J. Jill linen shirt was also a bins find and I got full asking price of $14.99. This Zara shirt is actually really cute, but it's been in my eBay store for almost two years. So when somebody offered me a really low ball $4.99 offer, I took it because it was a bins find and I'm still making a little bit of money. This scarf is another old bins find that I paid less than a dollar for and sold for $6.75. Cycling jerseys are usually a pretty quick flip for me. This one sold for full asking price of $14.99 and was a bins find. I picked up this Patagonia at the bins for less than a dollar. I accepted a best offer of $14.50 on it and it was able to sell even with the logo on it. This Mountain Hardware vest was another bins find. I paid less than a dollar for it and sold it for full asking price, $34.99. Now with our packages out, we've got one more errand to run. So I work at the cutest little boutique in uh, my hometown and they have the nicest stuff for little kids. When they get their things wholesale, it comes in these plastic bags. Well, I put my items when I sell them in a plastic bag, so they save their bags for me, so they get to recycle. I put my packages in there and send them out on their way so they're protected. So we're recycling and we're reusing and we're just trying to keep things out of the landfill a little bit longer. So thanks girls for saving bags for me, and now I can send them on my way to my customer. Thanks guys, I hope you check out their website. I'll put the link in the description below. Okay, so I'm gonna head into the Goodwill Outlet. Let's go see what we can find. I've got all my work done this morning, so now I get to go have some fun. Let's go see what we can get. I'll spend a few hours today at the bins. I'll be looking for things that I can put in my eBay store and also trying to get some footage for the next video that's gonna come out next Wednesday. Plus, I'm gonna get to hang out with some of my friends. For me, I need about two hours worth of footage in the bins in order to create a video that's about 15 minutes. I always find quite a few good things at the bins. Some of them I'm gonna put in my eBay store and some of them I'm gonna keep for my family. So good day at the bins. <laughs> I find good to see all my friends. And now we're gonna load up the car and head home. Once I got home, I unloaded the car created a haul video that's going to go into next week's video, and now we're going to start on the loads of laundry that have to get done. But in between loads of laundry, we've got some other things that we got to get taken care of. Desperately needed. My hair colored. Now we wait. Now that my hair is done, let's watch some Yellowstone and fold some laundry. Just make it sure I'm in spring lake. Now with today's bins finds cleaned, folded, and ready for photos, we can get some listing done. While we watch some of our favorite YouTubers, I try to get about 15 listings done a day before it's time to go to bed. Good night, sweet dreams. Thanks for spending the day with me.